how to add an end screen at the end of your videos and how to put them on YouTube. So make sure you have your video, which it's all edited, it's perfectly done and you have your little template where you promote your other videos. So I already made one. I made this on Canva. This is where I made my other one, but I made there's only on Fonto, so I'll do one on Canva if you guys want to see that one. But I'll just put it down to four seconds because I don't want it to be too long or too short. So I just have that. Depending on where you edit your videos, you're just gonna download it. I just edit mine on iMovie. Just press the file and edit it from there. Then go to your YouTube studio, and um, as you're like publishing it, it should have come up with a second option saying end screen or cards. End screen is where you add it up. So just press this edit button, and this is like a timeline of where you can put your cards. As you can see, mine goes right there, and I'm just gonna show you guys for the video how to do them. So here are some templates, and they all mean different things. So you just have to read them, like playlist or video subscribe. I normally use this one, and you can always just adjust them around and stuff like that. You can actually delete some and just put the ones you want in. But I'm just using this one. So I'm just going to crop that to where my template thing starts. So it starts right there. I'm just going to shoot it down. And while you're doing it, you'll see this little like video upload. Best for viewer or choose specific video. I don't always go for best for viewer because YouTube will just pick the one that's like best suited for my audience. Or you can just choose a video of your choice, any video or your videos, or just your most recent upload. I just choose that one. And as you can see, depending on how long your video goes for, or how short your video goes for, or how your template, if your template's short or long, it will depend on where it starts. So mine, my video is still going. As you can see, it already came up. And it ends right there. So it doesn't really bother me too much because it's just at the end so I'm just gonna size it up a little bit and move this one around there and it doesn't matter if it's too big because no one's gonna see your black screen just like an indication of where you can go so I'm just zooming that up and this one's just gonna go right there and it's really hard for your subscribe like icon bit because you don't like it too big because they're gonna see your black screen it doesn't really matter people do it it's fine but i just like it like not to be shown because i just don't know i just like it like that so yeah um that's a tutorial on how to do it this was actually requested by one of my viewers so make sure you guys leave some suggestions down below of what you guys want to see and i'll bring it out to you guys so thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.